Hello there guys and welcome back to Keeper Roguelike. Okay, so last time we uh, we kind of built a dungeon that doesn't make sense, but who cares, you know. As I say, as I've said previously, I haven't really played that much, so I, have, I don't really have any experience in it. I just want to show you guys how cool it was. Okay, so let's carry on. Now, I'm still worried because we haven't seen one adventure yet. And I think maybe we need to build, maybe we need to build the thingy first before any come the prison and torture room. That doesn't make sense though. Why would you do that? I have no idea. But we can make a few. So if we have a prison like that, and then we'll have a torture room, um, we're gonna have it right to the next door to it. That's fine. I'm happy with that. Shouldn't take too long. Oh god, we are really producing a lot of um, good quality stuff, aren't we? Is that a two-hander? It's a Warhammer, that probably is a two-hander. And if that's the case, then I really want my gob... Go... Uh, no! Get training, you bastards! You're my... You're my front line. Get training. Anyway. Um, what was it doing now? Can you equip it? Ooh. I don't know if that's two under though. I mean, it looks like it could be. So, I suppose, yeah. We'll put that there. There we go. I might even invest in ranged. I mean, I'm not too sure where it's good. But then it might be useful for the gnomes since they are pretty weak. I'm just thinking. Hmm. Well, obviously, the beasts aren't going to be able to bloody hold bows or anything like that. They're not going to be able to equip anything. That's what I mean as well. They're not going to be able to equip anything. So that's not necessarily right thing. But they do cost less. Raven only cost five. I don't know how good they are though. They might be absolutely useless for all I know. Uh, maybe we sh maybe another goblin. Or should we just focus more on the library? We need a larger library. Okay. No big deal. We can sort that out very easily. We'll make a six from this time. There we go. I don't know if you, if it, if you require more workshops for better gear as well. That it, it, I suppose it would kind of make sense in a way because of the way the library works. But I have no idea if that really is the case. Same with the alchemy, the laboratory. Sorry. So I'm actually going to build another. Uh, oops. I'm going to build another three. And yeah, you can actually cancel them just by left clicking again, which is really weird. But it's fine. And still, no single enemy yet, which is really uh, weird, especially considering it's supposed to be aggressive. Oh, we should probably put a light in there as well, make it look a bit more pretty. So as they can see what they're brewing, would be a good idea. Okay, we got a fear trap, nice. Um, I'm actually really tempted to stick that there, right in there, there we go. And another gas trap. I guess I'll stick that there. I have no idea if that placement is going to be any good, but hey, but we'll try it. We'll see how it goes. Oh my god, we really are. We really have a lot of storage problems. We need more storage. Wow. Okay, looks like I know where I'm going to uh, put the next lot of storage. Uh, I'm going to have to do this though, aren't I? Make this big. Yeah, let's do that. I'll put the I'll put the next lot of storage here. At least then it's going to stay empty for a while, it ain't, it ain't gonna get um, full anytime soon, whereas this one is rapidly getting full. We can build bridges, that's really cool. We don't know what the graveyard's for, I'm not 100% sure, but we can build a few. Maybe it's for the dead people. That would matter. That would kind of make sense, wouldn't it? So let's build it by the prison, just in case they die. I don't know if you get extra bonuses from doing that, but it would make sense if that was the case. Okay, we're gonna build bigger build a big storage area. That uh, oh, had to do it, didn't it? Stupid. There we go. Okay, that'll do. Come on, where, where, where's the action? C come, come and get me, bro. Come and get me. Oh my god, but well, why, why aren't they coming? I have no idea why they why they aren't actually trying to get my loot. There's lots of loot. There's 442 loot. Come and get it. You bastards. <laughs> I have no idea why they're not coming. Um, right. 
let's see what we can do now. Now we can probably focus on, I don't know, actually, maybe sorcery and then archery. That sounds like a good idea. Definitely. Yeah. We'll do that. Uh, we've got two more. Wow, we've got surprise traps. What the hell are those? Seriously, what the hell are surprise traps? Um, workshop surprise trap. It teleports nearby minions to deal with the trespasser. Ooh, surprise trap. I like the sound of that. Uh, weather gone. Okay, so we'll stick one there. We'll stick one there. And maybe one there. That was probably a bad place for that one. There, there we go. That'll do. Yeah, that'll do. That's that's great. And everyone's still happy with each other. Don't like that. Well, this is a this is a bit poo. Why aren't they coming? Seriously, I mean the last the, the I've I've played two games this so far, and both times they've just rushed, they've just stormed through. This is really weird that they're not even bothering doing that. Have I have I broke the game or something? Has it just turned into a building simulator of sorts and not a roguelike? Like I have no idea what I've done to it, but no one's coming, and it's annoying. 3,000 turns, I'm pretty sure stuff should have spawned by now. I'm really, I'm really thinking that I broke it. <laughs> I hope not. I really hope not. Yeah, wow, we, we, we have a lot of weapons and items now. Might be worth our building some more, yeah, building some more goblins. Yes, Fang, summoning some more goblins. It's nearly as bad as bloody digging down trees. Um, yeah, let's just max it out. Screw it. There we go. Now we, now we should have plenty of goblins to defend. Kill or torture some innocent beings for more mana. I would love to, but I have no idea how we even go about doing that. Maybe if I can try one of the goblins and go and explore. That seems like a good idea. Shall we do that? Do you know what? I'm actually really tempted to do that. I'm gonna do, actually. I'm gonna do it with an. Should I do it with a gnome or have I got... Mm. Oh, hello, hello. Action. Brilliant. So let's see how this works. Um, this might completely fuck up. I have no idea. But it's fun. So let's just wait and see what happens. Bloody humans. Come on. Come on. You know you want to. Um, we still need more mana for that. But we might get even more mana now if we can kill the... Ah, here we go. Here we go. Fight, 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 fight. Oh, literally all of the... Okay. Yes, we know they're attacking. I can see that. I can see here that they're attacking. And... It looks like we're winning. And we have actually got a nice bit of a chow point there, which is quite nice. But that's it. Uh, I think we... Yeah, I think they've scared them. Go get them. Go get them. Go get them, mate. Go on. Go on, go on, go get, go get him. Aww. Get back here. Okay, so now we've got a load of dead, but oh, oh, we're still going, we're still going. Uh, hang on, hang on, wait a second. What am I down to? I've still got tons of goblins. And there's only one dwarf. This has actually worked out pretty well. Okay, now there's a few more. There's a vulture. Wow, okay. <laughs> um, this ain't working too bad. Um, I do wish that... Oh, they're wounded. I wonder if there's any way I can actually heal them. Oh, I can do as a keeper, I suppose. If I possess the keeper, I can go and uh, heal them, I suppose. That would be a good idea. Come on, Mr. Keeper. Oh, lordy. <laughs> Oops. Um, that was probably not the best waste of ideas. Let's cast a spell. Let's cast summon insects, maybe? Um, yeah, let's do that. Let's cast... So why do you have to spawn at the opposite side? Oh my god. Yeah, go and kill him. Go and kill him. Can I cast it again? No, I have to wait turns. Oh, bollocks. Okay, well, let's just go off that tip. No, 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 no. no. Um, undo that. Right, now we've got five. Where are these goblins then? Go, go and... Right, I'll tell you what I'm going to have to do. I'm going to have to find it. I'm going to have to get a valley point, aren't I? Where's, where's the valley? Um, the guard post. There we go. 
let's stick one there. There we go. Let's have a guard post there. Let's hope that right. The keeper's engaged in combat. Do you want to control him? Yeah. <laughs> Fucking run. <laughs> right. Stay there. Stay there. Don't go anywhere. Okay. Let the goblins deal with it. Let the goblins and the gnomes that are used this deal with it. Oh dear. Um, that could have gone better. Let's get more goblins. Let's just fill up on goblins. And they can go and um, do them. Oh yeah, the beds are destroyed. That's interesting. Oh, we got a prisoner. Yes. Ha ha ha. Oh yeah, looks like those go there. I'm not 100%. Oh, those are ours. Our corpses. That's interesting. Did we kill them all? Looks like we did. Yay! We actually did something right for once, which is nice. Uh, we actually got more gold from that, which is a, a pretty nice as well. I suppose that makes sense. Hey, defended our first um, attack. Brilliant. I've never, I've never actually done that. <laughs> which is hilarious. I can actually send to prison, torture, execute, send to labour. Ooh, what do we do here? He's actually got construction. Maybe we should send him to labour. There we go. I wonder what he's going to do. Is he actually going to do anything or is he just going to stand there like a Muppet? He's probably just going to stand there like a Muppet. He's escaping! Oh no he's not, okay. <laughs> I thought he was escaping, he was like, ah, you let me free, yeah, I'm going to run away. No, that's that's not the case. Okay, um, let's try some archery. Oh, we've actually got more mana. Got loads of mana from that defense then. Stone golems. Those sound like proper tanks. Ooh, ogres. We do need a larger library now for that, so that's pretty easy. We've still got plenty. Of, wow, we got loads of wood. Yeah, we're not gonna have a problem with wood, I don't think, for a while. So let's. Uh, Let's get this library sorted. Uh, I'm just thinking what else we need. Might need more beds. And that was probably not the best place to have put them. I, I knew it. I bloody knew it. Okay. Um, I'm just debating whether we should arch this off a little bit. Um, would that be a good idea or not? Hmm... Right, let me make this a bit bigger. And then what we'll do is we'll do one there. Then we'll make like a bit of a a common room there for the beds. Yeah, that sounds like a good idea. Oh shit! Whoa, 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 what's going on here? What's going on here? What have I done? What have I done? There's water. Okay. Um Well that's not good, is it? That's not good at all. I don't think there's Z levels in the game, so I'm not really worried about water spilling up, but that's still not a good thing. <laughs> okay, well, we'll build in here. That, that should be fine. I'm hoping it's fine, because if it's not, then we're screwed. There we go, got plenty of beds now. So now it's time to summon some big massive fuck off ogres. Let's see. I can summon two. Okay. Oh no, the Dwarven Halls of Attacking. But before the deal, I want to check out these Ogres. Okay, so... They can also have 20 weapons. Let's look at the description. The Ogre is a large humanoid creature. It is strong and agile, but slow. Makes sense. Equipment. Oh my god, a big massive fuck-off battle axe. Oh yes, please. <laughs> Go and do your stuff, lads. Go on. Go on. You can give it some. Okay, so once that alarm sounds, then they should be good to go. I'm assuming we're not making many um, pots. Um, yeah, we're not making much pots, are we? You know what I'd actually like? I, I know I know it's an alpha and whatnot. But I would like maybe a... Like you've got here, but maybe like a list of inventory, what we've actually got in the stockpile, so as I can see what weapons and potions and stuff we've got. Because at the moment, all you can, all you can, the only way you can do it is by looking visually at it. Which is, uh, it's kind of a bit daunting. It would be nice to see how many I've actually got of everything. 
or maybe even influence what's being made because you can see there's tons of traps and I don't really want them yet and tons of weapons that I don't really want and tons of chests you know maybe maybe some legs you know or some feet or head you know that'd be cool be cool if you could do that that's all I'm saying but yeah okay let's carry on let's see what goes on here oh boy oh yeah the alarm worked well didn't it that was sarcasm by the way <laughs> if you didn't get that hey at least uh, at least we killed some yay you have exterminated the armed force of the dwarven halls oh boy and yeah they're kind of at war now yay and we've actually no we've actually conquered them completely bloody hell <laughs> bloody hell well this is going a lot smoother than the last uh, few times I've played so they this is good although we have hardly any bloody mana which is annoying as hell but we do have another prisoner or is that the same prisoner no we've got another prisoner we should debate him should we torture him <laughs> let's torture him um you're at labour and you're being tortured. There we go. I wonder if we get much uh, mana out of it. That'll be nice as well, seeing how much stuff we actually get for this. Because you can't quite tell. I can't actually tell if that's giving us more mana or not. Oh, oh, maybe it is. Yes, it is. Wow, that's a ton of mana. Fuck that. I know what I'm doing now. I'm making more bloody prisons. Screw that. I am making a lost opportunity like this. Uh, go at all there we go let, let me build the fucking let me build the torture room there we go yes more torture ha 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 we do need more prisoners though and I wonder if they could actually die it looks like that it's kind of oh I think we might have killed him um I have a feeling we killed him. Let's torture the other one. Just for shits and giggles. While we get more mana. Which I'm very happy with. Stone golems. Mm, go on then. That actually opened up for iron golems. Cool. Oh, okay. It's a brand new branch. Cool. Um, I'll tell you what then. We'll, we'll summon two. And let's just see what... They actually are. I'm pretty sure they're like tanks. They're they're basically there to. No, they can only train. That's any problem. Description. Is a large and non-living beast with arms and legs. It is weak, clumsy, and slow. Okay, so basically it's completely fucking useless, and it can't use any equipment. Oh, Fang, why did you do that? Why? It's more muscle, I suppose, in the end. So that's not really that big of a deal. Yeah, what we could probably do with though is probably more goblins and gnomes to go and especially gnomes actually there we go let's get some more gnomes so they can actually build some more useful stuff or at least um, brew some useful stuff that'd be a good idea it's going well so far considering so i'm really happy with that and it does look like when stuff breaks it doesn't you do need to be able to replace it so that looks to be the case. That's a shame. I wonder if there's anything else we'd actually research that would be useful. I mean, possibly necromancy. That might be cool. M m you might be able to get zombies. Hey, an another game with zombies in it. Hey. <laughs> but no, in all seriousness, that'd be really cool if you could uh, could summon some zombies or even stuff like I don't know, maybe werewolves and stuff like that'd be really cool. But we'll see. We'll see. Maybe that might be under beast, actually. Maybe werewolves, or maybe it just might be wolves, full stop. I wonder what that legendary one is. It requires the humanoid mutation. I wonder you get that. Hmm. Not 100% sure on that. And what's more interesting is that <laughs> they're not coming to me. They're like. Where are you, bra? Where are you? And they just don't come in. Oh, more god down there. Okay. 
But don't think we don't actually need any more resources yet, do we? I mean, we've still got plenty of iron and stone and wood, so that's not really a big deal. We might as well just let this play out as it is. I'm just thinking maybe more gobbles or or maybe we should just focus on research. Yeah, focus on research. I think I might even just that. <laughs> That's actually annoying. I mean, I don't have any else here do anything like that, but that's bloody annoying. I want to put that there. There we go. <laughs> okay. Right. We actually seem to have less gold now. I'm pretty sure we had 477 previously. Now we've got 475. Maybe some of the dwarven bastards managed to nick some of our gold. Hmm. Not 100% really sure. Oh, I'll tell you what, let's have a look at black market since we've got some gold. Can we buy stuff? Amulets. Ooh, amulets of healing. Do you know what? I'm going to buy one of those, even though I've only got a little bit of money. But that'd be cool. Let's do that. There we go. Now, I'm just going to equip it. It doesn't really matter at this point, I don't think. But we've definitely got a lot of equipment, so I'm beginning to think that maybe everyone is more or less equipped well. So we can quickly check that. Oh yeah, and yet this gnome has nothing at all. Oh my god. Um, well that'll be useful, wouldn't it, if this particular gnome had something there? Wow, look, look at the fifteen swords. I mean, that's bloody, that's bloody hilarious. That is. Okay, let's let, let's equip that one. We've got no range weapons yet because for some reason we haven't crafted any. Um, oh, that's a thought as well. Does crafting actually take up resources? That's a good point. That is actually a really good point because I haven't seen Unger down or anything. And if that's the case, you need to be able to try and limit what you make. Because otherwise, um, you can, any Tom, Dick and Harry will try and make random stuff that you don't need. And could even waste resources doing that. So that's definitely something That's definitely something to bear in mind. Oh, the Keeper's got the amulet. That actually makes sense. <laughs> Uh, potion of healing. Oh yeah, everyone's got a bit of the consumables, ain't they? Hey, you gotta put him down those consumables. Hey, hey. Uh, right. Okay. Uh, let's, this is gonna take bloody ages doing this. Uh, do, 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 do. It's a shame it doesn't auto equip. It really is. It looks like some of them do, but some of them don't, which is really weird. Really damn weird. I wish there might have been like, I wish there even an auto equip button you know a quick button that'd be pretty cool we don't have any boots so that's definitely something they should really be focusing on making boots we can't influence that unfortunately so even ranged weapons would be ideal at this point as well yes I know I know the description I'll, I'll, yes my mouse is acting a wee bit funny I'm blaming my mouse at this point, and it's actually me. But, you know. <laughs> as long as you can blame something else, that's fine by me. Okay. Is that. I think we need two more equipped, don't we? Yeah, we do. But then that should be it. At least we've got enough body armor and bloody helmets. Nothing else, though. Weapons, armor, and bloody helmets. Yep. And body armor. Helmets. I'll do. Okay, I wonder how the others are equipped as well. The goblins should really be all equipped at this point. Yeah, it looks like they are. Wow, you've got loads of bloody uh, consumables, you greedy bastard. Leave some for the rest. Ay, ay, ay. Oh, they actually have no foe in? What the fuck? Can I actually learn that? That's interesting. Can I actually. I've, I've actually got the capacity to learn that. No foe in? It doesn't say. Huh. Ah. Maybe I need to um, research more. Even so, we we'll need to wait now until more people, adventurers, come. So as that we can get all their mana. And that'll be great. So I think I'm going to put, I'm going to stick another cut in here. And I'll see you next time.